these trees go. I should sneak over there at night. But uh, yeah, it's cold. It rained last night. Fall is here. We got the uh, tiller moved over to my friend's place. He's over there doing his garden. I think he's done with it actually. And I've got my tiller on. And so I'm going to start the exciting process of uh, tilling my garden. <clears throat> Alright, I'm in the process of doing my tilling. And I want to talk to you about something very serious for a minute. I want to talk to you about compost. In my bucket here, and down here on the ground, I am spreading out my compost that I've been collecting for close to a year. Next year, I expect I'm going to be planting some grass out here. And yeah, I can put uh, in the middle of the grass, I can put, you know, a row or two of some sort of garden. Um, but I want to put the grass in, and I think it's a good idea, not just because... Uh, it, well, the main reason is to keep out the, the weeds. And uh, so you can have grass coverage all around, and then uh, you know plant your rows in the middle of the grass if you so choose. Here is the health of my compost pile. I've got grass. That stuff over there is grass. You know I mix it in with the dirt. Uh, this is a bunch of apple mulch. Potatoes, volunteer potatoes. You know if you've got stuff that's volunteering in the middle of your compost that you can't be doing completely bad. Um, you know, and as I pick stuff up, I see gigantic earthworms in there. So, and uh, in this area over here, leaves. Leaves all back in there. And so I'm just uh, taking it and spreading it all around using the tractor there.
Okay, so that's the process of just sort of I grab it from the compost pile over yonder, put it in a bucket and sort of spread it around, and then I'm going to till it all in, and that's what you'll see next. Let's get lined up here. I'm going to go that down that line right there, sort of right up there, cut that line in half. Pile of my uh, compost there. 